All right, what's up everyone? It is time for part two of the Wonka menu from IHOP. All right, check it out. We've got Scrum Diddly Umptious Strawberry Hot Chocolate. All right, let's take a look at this before I even drink it. Yeah, it just smells like strawberries inside of hot chocolate, but you can't actually see any strawberries. It just looks like plain hot chocolate, but it does smell like strawberries. Then we've got the perfectly purple pancakes wonka's perfectly purple pancakes i can't see any purple yet in there but we're going to bite into it and see and then we have the daydream berry biscuit and i'll show that here in just a minute but let's try these pancakes before we do anything else all right actually let's go ahead and show the biscuit the hot chocolate here the pancakes all for a thumbnail get my fork out of the way there all right, here we go. So, I do not see any purple on this pancake. Hmm. There is no, well, there's, okay. Yeah, actually I do. Here, let's peel this back a little bit. There's purple in between the layer. Yeah, there we go. I wonder if that's like blueberry. I don't know. I haven't really read enough up on it, but look, it is purple. Let's smell it. No, it smells like regular pancakes, which that's fine. Probably food coloring. It's cool that it is purple. Put my Griffin syrup on here. Here we go. Mmm. It's got that cheesecake mousse again. Man, that is really good. Look at that. Purple pancake, cheesecake mousse. Mmm. So smooth and such a good bite. So we don't have any fruit in this. That's safe for the biscuit. It's just really good. Again, you almost don't even need syrup. The cheesecake mousse gives such a good flavor. And again, the purple isn't any different flavor, but this is like another chocolate pancake. Just a really sweet chocolate cheesecake syrup taste. So yeah, again, it's hard to rank pancakes, but these are very tasty and I hop. You know, it's a pancake staple. These are a solid nine again. Maybe nine two, since I said they're better than the pancake tacos. All right, let's try this hot chocolate. I think it's the perfect time. While it's still hot. Oh my, that is amazing. That is some good hot chocolate. You've got a very rich hot chocolate here mixed with strawberry flavor. There aren't any chunks of strawberry in it. That might be the most flavor I've ever had out of any hot chocolate. It's authentic strawberry flavor too, but again, you're not getting chunks of strawberry in there. So it's very smooth. I already love hot chocolate, so that makes it even better. It's a 9.5. Very, very good. It's almost like a Neapolitan hot chocolate. I'm just so good, obviously without the vanilla, but it's amazing, yeah. All right, last but not least, maybe we should have done this biscuit next. It's getting kind of cold, or maybe it's just the berries, but the Daydream Berry Biscuit. So we got a ton of blueberries in here, and it looks like more of that cheesecake mousse on two really soft biscuits here. And again, I don't like chunks of fruit and things, but this is what this is supposed to be, so I'm going to just go with it. Here we go. Look at that. It's definitely my least favorite of these three, just cause I'm not a big blueberry guy. And to me, blueberries go a long way. I feel like they didn't need to put quite as many on here. Because that taste goes a long way. And this is more like butter than cheesecake mousse. It doesn't taste like the cheesecake mousse. If it is, there's not much flavor. I'm a little disappointed in the biscuit. Just way too much blueberry flavor and not much else. I know that's what it's supposed to be and it needs to taste like what it's advertised as, but it's a little overpowering. I want a little more sweet taste than that. So this is like a five, eight out of 10, but the rest of it, the pancakes and the hot chocolate, they're amazing. They're an A and an A plus. So yeah, 
I'm still gonna eat the biscuit. I'm gonna eat all of this. I'm gonna go ahead and chat down. So as always, if there's anything you'd like for me to review, leave in that comment section below. I'll get to it, like, subscribe, hit the bell. Check you later.